Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sherelle. If you're new here, hi, how are you? Welcome to my channel. So today video, we are going to be eating chicken alfredo. I made chicken alfredo for dinner with five cheese, garlic, Texas toast, freezer style. <laughs> Straight from out the freezer uh, aisle at a grocery store. So, got my food y'all right here it's kind of blurry because y'all i don't know how to set my like settings to make it like focus on like everything because it's really just focused on the middle piece which is me and like when i have the camera where the food is it's still focused on me and i feel like the food be looking not clear as i want it to look Okay, y'all, so got my food. Sorry if it's not clear, but got my chicken Alfredo. And I, um, I made it with, so I made the chicken strips, like, into strip the chicken into strips, because I normally cube my chicken when I'm making chicken Alfredo instead of, making it strips so today I made it into strips because I had a lot of chicken so I can make it big enough so first bite mm. I love chicken alfredo when I make it homemade and this is just the same bread that I had when I ate my lasagna. I don't know why I put all this on my plate like I'm going to eat it all. So I got my handy dandy iced tea again. So y'all know I be getting full when I drink my iced tea. And I've been drinking on my iced tea as I was cooking. So I hope that doesn't affect how much food is on my plate that I can eat. It's steaming. Y'all probably can't see it, but. Mm. Y'all like chicken alfredo? Homemade. I make my sauce from scratch. I do not use the jar. Mm -mm. The jar, the jar is a no-no. I used to eat the ends, like the whole piece of bread, but lately I did. I don't be wanting this part. I just be wanting this part. I feel like for breakfast, I already had a lot of dinner. A lot of dinner. I feel like for breakfast, I already had a lot of food. Because my mama had her fish fry yesterday. And of course, it falls on the day I fast. So, I couldn't <clears throat> eat it yesterday. So, I took it to work with me. And I ate like fish and shrimp and fries at like 10 o'clock in the morning. I wish y'all can see my food better, but I'm sorry. Oh. Chicken alfredo. And I use the bow tie noodles. That's what I like to use now. Only thing I don't like about chicken alfredo is like it be real greasy, especially the next day. 
real greasy. Y'all, that Lipton Peach Iced Tea is very addicting. And I make mine real sweet, but not like too, too sweet. And if I do make a mistake and make it kind of too sweet, I'll leave it sweet like that. But I'll add like a lot of ice to it to water it down. I don't add more water to the pitcher when I'm making it. I just add more. I mean, I just add ice to my glass when I drink it. Piece of chicken. Grilled chicken. Greasy grilled chicken. Oh y'all, I got, I got some, um, Dairy Queen. I bought some Dairy Queen today. Y'all, it's a fly up here. I'm irritated now. So y'all, it is so hot up here. I don't have a fan. I don't have an air conditioner up here. I'm really hot. Y'all know I don't like doing videos like in a house when I have the family in the house. They're in the house. So that's why I'm in the closet. Well, it's a room, but y'all know what I mean. It's an actual room, but we use it as a closet. Oh, that's a big piece of chicken, y'all. I keep drinking my iced tea because I'm hot. So, if y'all wondering what kind of Dairy Queen I got, I got the, um, what is it called? The new one that just came out. Like, it's real new. Because when I went to, the first Dairy Queen I went to, they said theirs is not coming out until the 31st, the new ice cream, the new blizzard. It's not coming out until the 31st at their store. So I went to a, I was determined to get that. I went to a different Dairy Queen and at first they were struggling trying to figure out like what uh, ice cream, what blizzard I was talking about and they figured it out. But they have to, they don't even have the button on their little um, register 
So they had to ring me up for something different, but they knew what I was talking about, so they made it for me. So they had the ingredients. The first store, they didn't have the ingredients for the to make the blizzard. But I think it's called a caramel fudge. Stupid fly. It's called a caramel fudge cheesecake caramel fudge cheesecake blizzard and that's right up my alley because i love my royal new york cheesecake blizzard that's my favorite blizzard so anything with the cheesecake mm. and caramel i love cheesecake and i love caramel and, and them two items gotta be good So, what fast food do y'all think I should eat next? Let me know in the comment section below. I was thinking about Jersey Mike's subs, but I don't know. Because I've been seeing people eat Jersey Mike's. And one person in particular who was not a mukbang person. They used to be on YouTube a long time ago, this person. But they don't be on YouTube no more. And they wasn't a mukbang person at that but this was like a gazillion years ago. But I followed this person on Instagram. This person kept going to Jersey Mike's for a specific sub. Like, the addiction was real. I was like, she, uh, she screenshotted. Well, she wrote down, not wrote, but y'all know what I mean. She put on the, um, her story, the sub and what it is. So, I'm gonna go get that. I see what her hype is about with this sub. <laughs> Y'all watch All Queens Men. It's back on. So as soon as I eat this, I'm probably going to go and watch that. Well, I might wait till my food digest then watch it because I want to eat my ice cream while I'm watching it. I actually got a little bit left. I don't know if y'all can tell or not. I know I'm going to gain like 5 pounds today. All the food I ate today, plus the ice cream that's to come. I don't even want to get on that scale tomorrow. And I am done. The only thing on my plate is like the ends of the bread, okay? I ain't talked that much. Because I'm not a talker really, y'all. I just eat, okay? I don't really be having too much to talk about. <laughs> I just usually tell y'all what's on my mind. And then once I get that off... My mom. Did I just eat? I 
I don't know if I mentioned this in the last video. With this, the iced tea, you do not have to add sugar. It's already sweet. Just add enough of the iced tea to your pitcher. The more you add, the sweeter it is. So, you do not have to add sugar. I'm done, y'all. But I do want to say this. I just got done watching They Cloned Tyrone. That was a good movie. But I feel like if you're not woke on certain things about what's going on in this world, it might not be interesting to you when you watch it. Or you might not catch on to what's going on. You might know somewhat what's going on. But like they put it in our face on what's really going on in this world. But a lot of people that's not knowledgeable or people who like to call people like me conspiracy theorists. Um, they just won't get it. I don't know. Like, it's so much information out here. This, let me just say this. I think I've said it before in a video. I'm not sure, but I think I've said it. Someone said the truth is more disturbing I said that all wrong but the truth is more disturbing than the lie so we get told lies every day in this world with the government and all that type of stuff well through the government they give us lies they feed us lies and all these types of things but when they put the truth in our face in movies and stuff like that we, well not me, but I'm just going to say we, we automatically think it's fake and it's not real, it's not true because it's so disturbing and so far out there that it won't seem like it's true, but they actually be putting the truth in our face. <sighs> Y'all need to go watch They Clone Tyrone. It's on Netflix. So, if you ain't got Netflix, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know if it's on any other thing, but it's on Netflix. Y'all need to go watch it. Okay. Because I bet you a lot of people, probably a lot of my viewers, probably don't believe in cloning. Y'all, do your research. But anyway, I'm done. Thank you guys for watching. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you won't miss the upload whenever I upload a new video here on my channel. So, thank you for watching everyone and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!